Alaska lawmakers are going to see a 50 percent increase in retirement payouts. The governor signing that bill into law. But critics say that increase was passed quietly. Action 7 News reporter Andres Valle joins us in studio with details. Hey, Ron Darlene, New Mexico still is the only unsalaried legislator in the nation, meaning that those lawmakers aren't getting paid every time they're in session. And with the bill passed into law, they're hoping this could compensate them for their work. Come May 15th, legislators will be getting a boost in their retirement pension. The previous payout was just under $2,000 for each year of service. And come May, new retirees will be paid nearly $3,000 for every year they served in the legislature. The measure slipping through both the Senate and House in a matter of five days during the recent 30-day session, but not everyone was for it. You know, when, when it came up for vote, um, I voted no for it, and that's about all I got to say. I voted no on the bill. Um, and for me, I just didn't feel comfortable as a new legislator, le new legislator uh, voting yes on that. And even with Senator Harold Hope's vote against the bill, he understands why it passed and was signed by the governor. I will say people need to understand they've sacrificed a lot of years to do this. And so in a way, they also need support for the rest of their lives as well. To qualify for a pension, a member must serve at least 10 years in the legislature. They must also pay $1,000 to a pension fund each year they serve. And I did reach out to the sponsors of the bill, but did not hear back. The governor's office did let me know that taxpayers will not be affected. The legislative retirement fund is funded through contributions from each participating legislator, as well as from the tax revenue collected under the oil and gas proceeds. Reporting studio, I'm Andres Valle for KOET Action 7 News. Andres, thank you. The new calculation only applies to future retirees on or after the bill's effective date.